Hello, and welcome to Neighborhood House Charter School High School. I am Jamila By Grandson, the founding high school principal, and I am joined today by several educators from our high school program. We want to congratulate you on being accepted to our high school through the lottery. We know choosing the right high school is a really big decision, and we want to share as much information with you as we can so you can make a decision that is best for you and your family. We sincerely hope that you will decide to join our community in the fall. Before we get started, I want to share with you our mission statement because every aspect of our program is really connected to this mission. This is because we believe that all scholars can thrive at Neighborhood House. You will hear more about how our mission is infused into our program in the next few minutes. I'm going to start by sharing some logistical information that you might find helpful as you consider whether Neighborhood House is the right school for you. Then you will hear from educators from across our school who will share more information about their programs. Let's just start with some basic information about our school. Neighborhood House Charter School is a K through 12 school located in Dorchester, Massachusetts. We have approximately 800 scholars and nearly 200 educators across our three schools, the lower school, middle school, and high school. Our lower and middle schools are located at our Queen Street campus, which is right off of Neponset Avenue. The Center Street campus, which houses grades eight through 12, is located just down the street at our Center Street campus. This is right off of Dorchester Avenue in a very short walk from the Shawmut T station. For scholars who will be coming to school by MBTA, bus or train, free passes are provided. Each of our schools has slightly different hours to accommodate arrival and dismissal of all of our scholars. The Center Street campus hours are 7.50 a.m. to 2.40 p.m. with half days every Wednesday. We provide free breakfast and lunch to all scholars every day and breakfast begins at 7.30 a.m. Our school is great because we have small classes with a general education teacher and a second adult, whether it is a teaching fellow or a special education teacher in most classrooms, giving our scholars the individualized attention they need and engaging them fully each and every day. Special education services are available to any child who qualifies and IEPs are implemented. I also want to mention that we are committed to preparing our scholars for future life success after high school. For us, this means we are committed to ensuring that our scholars are fully prepared to succeed in and lead for a more equitable and rapidly changing future. Our program and approach is rooted in a strong belief in each of these elements you see listed here. Together, they make the Neighborhood House program special and really sets us apart from any other school in the city. Our academic program is rooted in the belief that for scholars to be engaged and invested in their learning, lessons much must be rich and structured. And what that means is that they're engaging in a way that allows for a variety of activities to help scholars understand the material while ensuring lessons are rigorous and preparatory. We offer a robust program of studies that has diverse course offerings to meet the needs of all scholars. This includes advanced placement courses, which we're extremely proud of. We currently offer advanced placement courses in biology, physics, U.S. government, language and composition, and literature and composition. In addition to the core subjects, our high school also offers electives in physical education, visual arts, performing arts, health, and technology. As scholars move through their high school years, they, are, they have more agency and more choices in which courses suit their needs, interests, and post-secondary plans. Additionally, all scholars participate in college and career pathways programming. Scholars in 11th and 12th grade have dedicated college and career pathways counselors and have many opportunities to explore 
most post-secondary options that are available after graduating from Neighborhood House. The social emotional support and the attitude of never giving up on kids is at the heart of everything we do. We work to support all scholars in overcoming any obstacles they may face that doesn't just include academic obstacles. We offer individual and group counseling and each scholar is also part of an advisory group. And scholars know they can count on their teachers and on all adults at Neighborhood House to support them each and every day. So as you can see in here, it's about supporting the totality of the child versus just the academics. At Neighborhood House, we truly care about our scholars and we believe in them, do not give up on them, and in turn, they do not give up on themselves. Our school values are ingrained in everyday experiences at Neighborhood House. We strive to develop scholars who seek knowledge, embrace effort, act thoughtfully, and commit to the common good. And we guide them to make good choices make things better, not worse, and respect themselves, others, and the community. Our values are important because we believe developing these mindsets and behaviors as young scholars are a key to their future life success, no matter the path that they choose. Scholars hear and see examples of these values each and every day. And I know that these values also resonate with you because you are seriously considering making Neighborhood House your home. And we thank you for that. Hello, my name is Emily Davidson and I'm the Director of Curriculum and Instruction here at Neighborhood House. I'm going to tell you a little more about our academic program at the high school. Our goal is to prepare our scholars for post-secondary and life success in a world and workforce that is reliant on critical thinkers, strategic communicators, and thoughtful individuals. We believe that with a competitive course offering, along with individualized guidance and support from advisors and counselors, all of our scholars can succeed. We believe education should be a collaboration between scholars, families, and educators. Our course offerings ensure scholars gain a well-rounded education while meeting graduation requirements set by both the Commonwealth of Massachusetts and NHCS. Our graduation requirements include the following. Coursework. Scholars must earn a minimum of 22 credits and must end the cumulative marking period with an average at or above 70. Assessment. Scholars must earn a proficient score on the English Language Arts and Mathematics Grade 10 MCAS test and a passing score on the Science, Technology, and Engineering MCAS. Future planning. Scholars must complete an application to a two or four year college and complete a post-secondary success plan with guidance and support from the Department of College and Career Pathways. You will learn more about this a little later. Scholars select courses to develop their interests while also gaining exposure to a variety of different subjects. As scholars progress through their high school career, they will have more choices and autonomy to explore subjects that interest them and support their post-secondary vision. Offerings beyond the core subjects of English, history, math, and science include Spanish and Mandarin, performing arts, visual arts, music, physical education, health, technology, and college and career readiness. We have a commitment to rigorous academics for all scholars. In addition to standard track courses, NHCS offers accelerated math and or science tracks, honors level, advanced placement, and special education courses. The advanced placement offerings include AP Bio, Physics, Literature, Language, and AP Government. We have designed our program to support every scholar, no matter their needs. We have many academic supports in place. Class sizes are small, with a gen ed teacher and a second adult, a fellow or special ed teacher, in most classrooms, giving our scholars the individualized attention and support they need and engaging them fully each and every day. Teachers hold office hours to provide additional support, and we also provide academic support classes. We believe in our scholars. It's part of who we are that we do not give up on them. Between our academic offerings and our approach to supporting our scholars, our scholars will graduate from Neighborhood House prepared for their post-secondary life success. We hope to see you here in the fall. Hi, I'm Jack DeCrisper, Special Education Coordinator here at Neighborhood House Charter School High School. I'm going to tell you a little bit about our special education services. 
NHCS Special Education Department has procedures and systems in place to receive scholars from other schools with IEPs or 504 plans. This starts with our team providing new families with detailed information as it relates to all special education processes and also specifics about how their scholars programming would translate to their new school environment. We truly prioritize meaningful conversation and communication with new families and scholars along with prior schools to obtain all relevant information to ensure a comfortable transition. To provide continued support for our scholars after graduation, our special ed staff work with our college career and pathways department to determine scholar unique vision and goals for after graduation. In that planning, we consider what additional supports and skills need to be addressed for scholars to be fully prepared for their transition after graduation. We also partner with post-secondary institutions and workplaces to communicate scholars' disability-related needs, provide special education paperwork, and establish what accommodations are able to be implemented in order for scholars to feel and be successful in pursuing their goals after high school. That's all the time we have for today. And I know I've only been able to address a couple of the most common questions we get about our special education services. If you have any additional questions, please email info at the NHCS and you will be directed to the appropriate person on the team. Thank you and we look forward to meeting you soon. Hello, hello everyone. My name is Tammy Faye Maneed and I'm the Director of College and Career Pathways at the Neighborhood House Charter School High School. College and Career Pathways programming is a very important part of the NHCS experience and it's what makes our school special. Our scholars actually begin their journey by taking college and career readiness courses starting in the middle school. As scholars advance through the middle school and into high school, the curriculum and programming become more robust and structured. This is where they are able to explore and reflect upon four essential questions. First one being, what brings me joy? Second, what am I good at? Third, does the world need me to do this thing? And fourth, how can I monetize it? When scholars are in the 11th and 12th grade, they continue to build upon the self-exploration that they've already done. And they're beginning to really focus on what their post-secondary plan will be. We work with each scholar by providing one-on-one -on -one counseling and guidance, as well as opportunities to visit college campuses and explore different career paths through the extended campus learning opportunities. This includes internships and job sites. We support the exploration of all post-secondary paths, including two and four-year colleges, trade schools, military, job force, etc. All scholars complete a post-secondary plan and must also complete the common application, which is a universal college application so they can return to the college process at any time after they graduate from the neighborhood house. We know that each scholar is unique in their own way. It is our team's job to help each scholar tap into their gifts and talents. If you want to learn more about the College and Career Pathways team, you can visit our website, www.thenhcs.org. Thanks so much, and I look forward to meeting you soon. Hello, my name is Joanne August and I'm the Dean of Culture at Neighborhood House Charter School. I'm so excited that you are considering to join our community this fall. Today, I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about our school culture and student accountability system. At Neighborhood House, we wanna create a culture and environment for scholars where they feel safe, where they feel heard, and where scholars have mutual trust and respect with their teachers. A typical day is designed to engage scholars all day long, both in their academics, and other activities and free time. 
there are many opportunities for scholars to engage and explore interests beyond the classroom. All scholars are part of an advisory group that meets once to twice a week. Advisory groups are small with about 13 scholars per advisory. Advisory is a place for educators to check in with scholars, share information, and support scholars. It's also a place where scholars can unpack, support, and hold one another accountable. There are several clubs and sports teams that a scholar can join. The club offerings change based off scholar interest and staff expertise. Some examples of clubs that we've offered in the past include a hacking club, a Super Nintendo gaming club, art, baking, a hair braiding club, step, community service, and student council. In order to keep families engaged and in the loop about their scholar, a report is sent to families via email regarding the infractions and consequences their scholar received that week. The report also informs families about how many legend pride points their scholar received for exceptional behavior and participation in class. We believe that school culture is a joint effort between scholars, educators, and families. What happens outside of the classroom is as important to the high school experience as what happens in the classroom. If you decide to join our community, there'll be a few opportunities for you to meet other NACS scholars and their families this spring and this summer they can attest to our community and culture. Until then, thank you for your interest in Neighborhood House, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Hi, I'm Rose Kanan, Student Support Coordinator here at Neighborhood House Charter School. As you may know by now, social emotional support is a key component of our overall program. Research indicates that social emotional health is the best predictor of a child's future achievement, better than any other single factor, including IQ and technical skills combined. It has been proven over and over that social emotional factors are a significant impact on academic performance. NHCS has always been ahead of the curve in providing social emotional support to its students and families. Social emotional support is especially important today as young people, especially teenagers, are facing new challenges that are unique to this moment in time we are in. At the high school, the student support team consists of administration and coordinators, including the principal, assistant principal, deans, director of student services, family engagement coordinator, special education coordinator, school, student support coordinator and service providers, including school nurses, school psychologists, counselors and interns, the therapeutic support specialists and speech and occupational therapists. So we have a really big team and we all work together to provide age and developmentally appropriate support as well as individual support to all scholars. If your scholar is referred to the student support team by a staff member for academic or social emotional concerns, the team gathers together for a meeting to discuss these concerns, lagging skills and strengths to create an individualized plan that will implement academic and social emotional supports for your scholar. We then follow up with meetings to continue to gather data, monitor progress, and make any changes to the plans if needed. And we always communicate and coordinate with your family along the way. In addition, we provide therapeutic supports for scholars, which include individual counseling, skill building groups, informal check-ins with counselors, social emotional advisory lessons, where students strengthen their social emotional skills, and case management to connect to community supports. Our team truly cares about the well being of every single one of our scholars. We are here to support our scholars and their families, and we look forward to meeting you and supporting you and your family next school year. Take care. All right. Uh, so, hi, everybody. Uh, my name is Scott Urban, and I am the athletic director here at the high school. Uh, and I am here to tell you a little bit about our program. Uh, we're a young program and we're growing. So it's, uh, it's very exciting to be able to share some of that with you guys today. Um, we're going to get started with our athletic mission statement and what we stand for um, as a school athletic program. 
We believe that athletics provide a positive outlet for students to build upon their education. Our program asks students to maintain themselves to the high, highest academic standard while also providing the opportunity for personal growth and athletic development. This is a privilege that we aim to provide to all eligible students. By putting on the NHCS uniform, you're acknowledging the need to carry out a serious set of responsibilities to your school, your town, and your team. Student athletes will learn the value of discipline and how it relates to the growth of a team. We also maintain the expectation that student athletes will learn how to productively cope with defeat, but also win with class and respect. While athletic achievement and high level competition are the pillars of our program, the foundation lies in the student athlete demonstrating the desire to seek knowledge, embrace effort, act thoughtfully, and commit to the common good. This aligns itself with the Neighborhood House Charter School's core mission and values. We maintain the mindset that community and culture within our school drive our performance on the field. And some commonly asked questions that we get about our athletic program are uh, the three items that you see on the screen here. Uh, number one is what are the varsity athletic offerings at NHCS? Um, the Massachusetts state system uh, calls for three sports systems or three sports seasons rather. So we start in the fall with cross country, which is a co-ed offering. Uh, we offer boys varsity soccer, girls varsity soccer, flag football, which is also co-ed, and then girls volleyball. In the winter, we offer JV boys basketball, varsity boys basketball, varsity girls basketball, cheer, which is co-ed, and also indoor track and field. In the spring, we offer baseball, softball, and track and field, which again is co-ed. Number two asks, which league does NHCS participate in for varsity athletics? This is our fifth year as an athletic program. The first four years, we started in the Massachusetts uh, Charter School Athletic Organization, otherwise known as the MCSAO. Um, and that is where all of the charter schools in the Boston metro area compete in. Uh, as of next year, we will also be participating in the Massachusetts Interscholastic Interscholastic Athletic Association, otherwise known as the MIAA. Um, we will be competing against other charter schools in this division, but also more importantly, we will be competing against other public schools in the division as well. And we will be in the division five. And finally, question number three is, what are the academic requirements to participate in varsity athletics? Um, we treat athletics as a privilege. It's a privilege to participate. Uh, and we hold students to a very high academic standard. So for that reason, student athletes must maintain passing marks in all of their classes for the duration of their season. Uh, throughout that season, academic eligibility checks will take place every Friday. So on a weekly basis, your grades will be pulled and checked. And if you are passing all of your classes, you are eligible to play. All right. And if there are any other questions, they can be forwarded to our Instagram page, which you can see linked on the slide here. It is at the NHCS Athletics. And that's all I have for you guys today. Thanks for checking in. Go Legends. See you later. Now that you've heard more about what makes Neighborhood House Charter School High School so special, we hope you're ready to join our wonderful community. Here are the next steps to joining this community. First, if you haven't done so already, you will need to accept your enrollment offer by March 23rd. Then the next step is to complete the enrollment registration materials through Schoolment within seven days of accepting the offer. This is a separate and additional step than accepting the offer. So it's a two-step process to make it official. We invite you to join us for the admitted family reception on March 22nd at 6 p.m. here at Neighborhood House's Center Street Campus. This will be an opportunity to meet some of the high school teachers, scholars, and other new families. Additional details will be sent to you via email, and we hope to see you there. 
And finally, we want you to get excited about joining our community and becoming an NHCS legend. There will be more opportunities to connect in the coming weeks and months before school starts in the fall. We truly hope that this brief presentation has been helpful for you as you consider your options for high school. We look forward to hearing from you and meeting you soon. And in the meantime, if you have any questions about enrolling at Neighborhood House, please contact myself or Michelle Williams and you will see her information here on the screen. Again, congratulations, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Bye-bye.